Hey YouTube, it's Annabelle. So I am getting ready for my daughter's one year birthday and I wanted to show you some of the things that um, I have prepared. And um, let's see. So first thing is her baby book. So I did a like review on this a long, long, long time ago. It is the Guess How Much I Love You Baby book. Um, and it is all filled with lots of stuff. I'm not going to show any of the pages. Um, but to make this, filling out this book, um, easier, because I didn't want to, like, make errors in the book, um, I have this calendar right here that I kept next to her changing table. And if she did anything new, or, like, the, her first day she did something, I wrote it on the calendar. And then that made filling out the book um, even better. So that way I didn't have to have this around. Because, as you can see, I already had ink on my finger. And I got some on the front of the book. And I want it to be as neat as possible. So that is how I... Oh, and there's another mark right here, I guess, too. So anyways, I tried to keep it as nice as possible. So I filled out the calendar and then used the calendar to fill out the book. Okay, so I'm not going to show you the front of her scrapbook because it has too much information on it. And um, I tried, I'm not going to zoom in on any of this stuff because I tried to cover up um, our information as much as possible, anything that's identifying. So, um, this is her baby book. This is her birth announcement. Our bracelets that we were in the hospital, that one's mine and that one's hers. And I just taped them, used double-sided tape and taped them together, so that way they were one thing instead of two. Um, and that's the front of her birth announcement and the back. Okay, and then we have her ultrasound pictures and my belly pictures. I, and we have a, the fun pictures that me and my husband took for um, our pregnancy pictures. And then me and my husband each wrote a letter to her. Well, we didn't know if she was a boy or a girl. So this was our letters to her. Let's see. And then these are from my showers. That was from one of my showers, and that one was from another one. And then all of this stuff, um, just some miscellaneous scrapbooks. These were my bracelets in the hospital. Um, her baby footprints, uh, her announcement, like, on the Internet. Let me go to the next page. Um, those are all her checkups. Those are fun things that happened this year. Um, that's just a page. I have not completed this one yet. Um, this was her first gift from um, a friend. Her little friend, who is like three or four years old from daycare, made her little airplanes. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. So I have to put those together. But I did a video on the pictures that we took for... Um, or explaining the pictures that we took monthly. And I thought that this would be way easier just to show you. So I did upload that video, but now here you can actually see the pictures and on the pages. And I made each one of these pages. I just got colored paper and then um, I found, because I wanted all the pages to be different and I wanted them to be um, kind of 3D. Um, I have a lot of pages. So um, I didn't want them super 3D, but I just wanted you to be able to tell that it's raised up a little bit. But so this is my daughter's one month pictures. She, I, this was my favorite picture when she was just little, and it, I, we come to find out that she doesn't look anything like that. She looks like that one. <laughs> so that was her one month pictures. Um, these are her two month pictures. We did with stuff out of her room. Her three-month pictures. Um, her birthday was right next to St. Patrick, or birthday. Her three-month, like, mark was right next to St. Patrick's Day, so we just put St. Patrick's Day in with this one because I didn't want to do a separate page for it. Um, but these are her bathtub pictures. And then we have four-month pictures. And those are her feet pictures that I was talking about. You can't really, they're not coming out really good. But there's a string of pearls wrapped around her toes. And her toenails are painted pink. And this was um, her first 4th of July in her five-month pictures. Duh. 
and this is our six months. So we were doing a lot of swimming at this time, so we did her pictures in her bathing suit. So totally cute. Seven month pictures are by far my favorite. I love, love, love these pictures. And I know it's angled, so you can't really see them very well. But, and they look really dark, but they're not that dark. My camera's just being funny. Okay, and let's see. There are her eighth month pictures and her nine month pictures and her first Halloween. And she was a little lion. So cute. <laughs> and let's see. And then we have 10 month pictures for their first Thanksgiving. Yay. And then her first Christmas. So we have ones of her um, looking at different things, making the face that she always makes. I don't know if you can see that. It's probably really blurry. Oh, well. But yes, anyways, these are fun, fun pictures. Okay, and then her one-year pictures are going to go here. <laughs> and then these are just some pictures of her coming home. This was her, let me find it, there we go. <laughs> this is her in the hospital. We packed her all up. We put her in the truck. This is my husband getting her out of the truck and taking her into our house. So very exciting, and then I have Welcome Home down here. And then these are some random pictures that didn't really go on any other one. So I have her in the hospital one week and first Valentine's Day on there. And then this was her first Easter. I wanted to put a little bit more pictures on here, so this one is not done yet. Da, 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 da. Okay, and then I am going to skip over a chunk in here because they are family pictures. These are the pictures of her with my brother, um, my husband's brother, um, and, like, all of our, like, cl like close family. So, grandparents, great-grandparents, all that stuff. Um, and then I have a Four Generations page with all of the Four Generations. And then this was our first vacation. Yay! Um, and let's see. And then here are just some smiles and stuff. The pictures aren't coming up good on this camera. They look really dark, and that one looks red. The pictures are way better than they're showing up. <laughs> and then this is, I'm not done with this page either, this is some of her first. Um, so I have her first tummy time up here, I have her first, like, solid food eating. This was her first water adventure, and this was her first snow of, like, this winter. Like, it was snowing when she was born, but obviously we weren't going to go set her in the snow just to take a picture. So this is the first um, snow of winter. And then I'm not done with either of these pages yet. Um, that is our Christmas card section. This is where some more Christmas pictures are going, like her with all of her presents. And I do have a stack of, like, special or pictures of special ornaments and um, fun stuff that we did. There's some more fun in the snow pictures, and then those are a couple of little tag things I'm going to put on the page, and then this is her um, scrapbook pages for her birthday, so very exciting, so if you've, gosh, it looks blue again, okay, so this is purple, this is zebra, obviously, and that is lime green, and the green's not even showing up right. Okay, so I found these thank yous. I was going to make her thank yous. Now I'm not because I could not do better than this. And I always say, like, thanks bunches or love you bunches and, like, all that kind of stuff. So it's a little bunch of banana. It's so cute, and then that's the envelope. So I'm going to add more to this once we actually have her birthday party, but um, that's... We're doing, like, the front and the back side of her invitation, and then this is just, like, a banner for the start of the pages. So there's going to be four pages of her first birthday, and let's see, yeah, I'm not going to, we have all of her, since we live in a small town, we were, like, big news. <laughs> so, um, she was in the paper, um, and in advertisements and stuff like that. So we have all of those are in the very last page of her scrapbook. So, um, but anyway, so that's her scrapbook that she has from her first year. Um, 
her baby book goes up to two years, and so we're kind of kind of put her first in there. These are going to be kind of specific memories. So, um, and we're going to do this for all of our kids. So this is not just because she's our first. Um, and let's see. Um, and then this book that I showed you over here. Okay, so I'm going to get a scrapbook that, oh, and that picture's not showing up either. Ah, oh, the pictures on here look really bad. Oh, well. Um, but anyway, so I'm going to take something from their birthday, and I'm going to try, well, and it might be I find the book and match it to the birthday. That might be how it goes. But I found this, and I fell in love with it. It's a zebra scrapbook. So this is going to be for, um, like, all the important things that happen to her or she does or anything like that while she's little. And she can scrapbook, like, when she gets older, like, obviously. And from now on, like, we're going to take 18-month pictures um, with her, like, how we did the monthly pictures. We're going to do 18-month pictures, and then we're going to do yearly after that. So we're going to do her two-year, three-year, four-year, five-year, da 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 So she is going to, like, have, like, memories and, like, the special fun times that we all had together like, now in their first year, because it's just so special, and they grow and change so much, and it's just super fun. Um, but yes, so that is going to cover, like, her, did I mention that pictures are just going to go in photo albums? I don't know if I said that already. I might have. Um, but yeah, so any pictures that we take from now on that we want to keep, um, we are going to keep in a file, like, on our computer, obviously, and, um, we're going to, like, print out the special ones and put them, like, in a regular photo album, and they won't be on a scrapbook page. Um, and some people say that I have way too much time on my hands, but it is really, it's easier than what you think to do good scrapbook pages. Like, it really is. Like, this page or whatever, these are the napkins from her birthday party that we're going to be using. Like, this is, like, her thank you. Like, well, we're going to add, obviously, some more stuff, and we're going to do, like, wallet size pictures probably in this section, just because there's probably going to be a lot of pictures. Um, but as for, like, monthly pictures, like, just for an example, like this one, like, we did Ladybug theme, and we found, like, you can find sheets of um, stickers, and, like, we didn't know we were going to have a boy or a girl. So, some of... Some of the pages I had done in advance, such as these two. And so these, the only ones that I didn't put on here, and you can't see these very well. There's a monkey! <laughs> um, but yeah, okay, so can you see these? Like, this is ones that I had, like, made up beforehand. So even though you might be like, okay, well, the orange and the yellow would probably be more for a boy than a girl, well, um... We took jungle pictures for this one because her daddy bought her this onesie. And uh, these are bath time with ducks, so the yellow, like, matches perfectly. So it can go for a girl or a boy. Um, now, obviously, some of the pages, like her seven-month picture, I did not have this done until after she was born because it's, like, completely girly. Like, this can go either way. The hearts, obviously, like, it would work maybe if it didn't have a purple background for a boy, but like this one, this is a blue background with black like stickers, and they're like a felt. But her Fourth of July pictures, like they're red, white, and blue, so they go perfectly with it. Um, holy cow! Okay, so I'm talking way too long. So, anyways, so, so that's our book, um, and I still have some stuff. I'm 95% complete, um, or it's 95% completed. So I have some work to do. But anyways, um, you all have a wonderful day, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye, guys.